Hi all, Pierce from The Creel here. Tonight we'll be using some products that we stocked on at The Creel Deli to bring you a rich and warming mushroom papadelle. Firstly, slice up some of your favourite mushrooms. We went with some flat caps and chestnut mushrooms for their texture and earthy flavour. Set them together in a bowl for later. The bordiceps from The Creel Deli have been rehydrated in water overnight. We'll give them a quick chop. Don't worry, full set of instructions will be available in the post if you're finding it difficult to follow this. Next, grab an onion and dice it up nice and finely like this and then set it to the side. Now take three cloves of garlic and give them a rough chop and then pop them aside with the onions for later on. Finally for the fresh parsley, give it a nice fine chop and set it aside. We are using about two tablespoons of fresh parsley here. Now let's move over to the hob. To your pan, add around two tablespoons of olive oil to evenly cover the bottom of it and bring it up to a medium high heat. Add in those onions and garlic and cook them for a couple of minutes until fragrant. Then add all your mushrooms and saute until they take on some nice colour. Things should be coming together nicely now. Add 100ml of white wine, anything drinkable. Bring it, bring it together with a nice stir. Gently add two tablespoons of liquid drained off from the rehydrated ordiceps earlier. Make sure everything is combining nice and evenly. Toss in the bay leaves. Allow a little time for the water to be reduced by half, then gently add 200ml of cream. Give your dish a good mix. Add in the mascarpone to add some more richness to this dish and combine well. Finally add your truffle oil, add your parsley and set on low to cook. To cook the pasta follow the instructions on the packet. To finish off your dish add the pasta and some starchy cooking water into the pan and combine your dish in the pan. Mix until the pasta is well coated with a nice thick sauce. This looks absolutely delicious. Now for the best part. Take a little time to plate up your dish in your favourite pasta bowl. We've went and curled ours around the kitchen tongs but a carving fork would work equally well here. Let's add a nice tiny drizzle of truffle oil over the top, followed by some freshly grated parmesan. No judgments will be made on how much you're adding here. Add some garnish and voila, enjoy. If you're a fan of our recipe videos, give us a like and a comment. We'd love to hear from you.